And then we have the infamous one. The one that started it all. About the man on my shirt right this now. This got him the graphic. The, the this best, got him the album cover. This got him the graphic. The best defensive player in the history of the NBA, Sir Ben Wallace. Sir Ben Wallace. Sir. Who Sam Flannel is on record saying does well, not you know what? deserve. Let's, let's not speak for him. Now that we have Lindsey Hunter, one of <laughs> Ben's teammates, other four, championship guy with him, right? Please. You I will be calling him after this. Give him, give him I will reason. be calling him after this show too. To let him. Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure. Hell yeah. Yeah. Yes, we got him. I'm, I'm sure going to call him on different things. We got relate. Anyways, go ahead. You know what? You might be the per- person to bounce this off of because you played with him. Oh jeez. I believe that Ben Wallace should not be in the Basketball Hall of Fame. <laughs> <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> I'm choking. Oh, yeah, I know, dude. That's why I brought you the water. But c- continue, continue with the kill. Oh, God. Yes. Okay, so in my opinion, I mean, I, I don't even think this is opinion. I think this is fact. Of all of the people, of all of the players who are in the Basketball Hall of Fame, Ben Wallace is the single worst at putting the ball through the hoop and scoring. 5.7 points per game for his career, 9.6 rebounds. Every stop he has made in his career, except for Detroit, where he was a phenomenal defender and a worthy all-star, he was terrible. He was terrible on Orlando. He was terrible on the Bulls. He was terrible in his second stint with the Pistons. Oh and this is just, I think we can all agree on this. If the going-to-work Pistons do not win the championship in 04, nobody's on the Hall of Fame on that team. But we did. Okay, fair, fair. I'm, I'm, I'm going to get and to it. And the fact that, that, that what was done was done. But to your point, is your point to Lindsey because, because of his offensive ability when we're talking about the greatest defensive player of all times? Is that what it is? Because you just don't think that anybody with that – with those offensive stats, it's it's the punter kicker in the in the NFL the Hall of Fame. Well, first off, he's not the best defensive player of all time. I think Hakeem Olajuwon, Bill Russell, Tim Duncan, Dennis Rodman, they might have something to say about that. Just just for the record, although he is an all time great defender. My thing with the championship and the Good, top five is usually in the Hall of Fame in the career. <laughs> I just wondered how many named up because I agree with them, but then okay, in the 04 finals. This narrative has been perpetuated, which I think is just blasphemous on a million different levels, that Ben Wallace shut down Shaq. Shaq was the only one in that series who was ball, and if anybody on the Lakers played a terrible series, it was Kobe. And you never hear about Tayshaun Prince getting enough credit for locking his ass up. Shaq balled out. He averaged 26 and 11 in that series on 63% shooting. In one game, he got 34 and 11. And a lot of people would say, oh, but Ben Wallace was able to kind of lock him one-on-one, which no one else could do. I think a lot of centers could have held Shaq to 34 and 11 and 36 and 20. The only game where Kobe played well, game two, the Lakers actually won. Ben Wallace did not shut down Shaq in any way, shape, or form. Ben Wallace was not the main reason that they won that finals. He was a very important piece on that team. But why isn't Chauncey in? Why isn't Rip in? Why is it just Ben Wallace? That is something that has boggled my mind to this day. But but Lindsay, as someone who's played with him, what makes Ben Wallace so valuable? I can see that you obviously disagree wholeheartedly with me. With everything you just said. Okay, okay, (laughs) fair enough, fair enough. (laughs) Hey, Lindsay, I knew you, I told you this, trust me, trust me, you'll have fun at some point. Look, no, no, I knew knew this was coming, I didn't know it was Ben, but when he said that Tom Brady was the luckiest player to ever play to football. I was like, something's crazy. Did you see last night's game? <laughs> this so, man said Tom Brady's the luckiest. Can you show the people the, the album cover? I will. Because this is his greatest hits. This is why the Legend Killer has his own <laughs> album, bro. <laughs> right? Why he's the Legend Killer. Can you please respond or just maybe okay. with some personal feelings from Playing there, being there, and Sam, I like how you asked that. Yes. Maybe you're miss. Maybe you're missing. Oh, oh, wow! Stuff in the everybody who's watching at home. That's called a block. That is a block. <laughs> All right, go, go ahead, Liz. Well, um, just listening to you, I, I'm 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 almost speechless. 
I, I, I'm really looking at you like, man, I, I just need to take you to a basketball game and you sit right next to me so I can kind of teach you the different aspects of basketball. Because if it was just an offensive game, if we were just purely going on offense, there would be a lot of guys in the Hall of Fame who could just score, right? Sure. That, that you know, and I'm not even quantifying winning in it. Let's just say we didn't win the 04 championship. Ben still has how many defensive player of the year? Four. 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 How many people have that many? Nobody. One. Or is it? How many? Ben and I, I, mean, I, I got, got four balls. rings. Yes. Ben's yes. got four yes. player yes. of the years. I yeah. mean, that's how many people have, How many people have that many? I just one. Just him. Just ten. Yeah. So you can argue that he's probably top three greatest defenders of all time. I, I still would. I you still have four defensive yeah, players. Yeah, Sam loves the Tom Masway, Bill Russell, nineteen fifties guys yeah. that uh, played against male You can't plumbers. guys who were born before you. Yeah. Played, played before you were born. So, so have you ever looked at uh, Bill Russell's stats? Yes, I've looked at Bill Russell's stats. Were they amazing? No. Not uh, not counting stats, they weren't. But they were better than Ben Wallace's counting stats. Yeah, but he stats. only played against ten teams. That's true. But Ben Wallace objectively was horrible at offense. He was one of the worst offensive players I've ever seen. I'm just well, saying. Well, I'll give you. I'll give you what you know. If you that's your opinion. Uh, you saw him like I think he scored like what in the finals. He scored like 17 points, 18 points in a game, right? Oh Hitting man. Jumpers. Do you remember? Give him a cookie. Give is is, is in the oh finals. In the finals. 17, 18 points in oh. the finals. Take a bow, Ben Wallace. In the Take finals. a bow. In the I finals. mean, Shaq scored 36 wait, and 20 wait. on him. As just, your <laughs> shutdown guy, that's in the too, you know what you what he's saying is like you know Dmac scored the Stanley Cup clinching goal right. in '97 in Game Four of the clincher, which is like you're saying. My question to you: How many? Times was Ben Wallace asked to put the ball in the that, hole. We, we've never asked him. Never asked. That because was usually his 18 points in that playoff game is because everybody else was shut down. So, so I want you to, um, I want you to go back and look, look at his college stats, okay? Virginia Union. Yeah, he was. I mean, obviously at Virginia Union, he put up numbers. Oh, did he? Yeah, at Virginia Union. So here, here's my point. You know, I was like top two in the country scoring when I was in college, right? Sure. 27 sure. points a game. Oh, yeah. I couldn't do that in the NBA because there were guys better than me. I wasn't asked to do that. I know, but nobody's arguing that but Lindsey then, Hunter's a Hall of Famer. No, but but yet and still, I didn't have four defensive player of the year. If That's I true. did, I would be argued and as a Hall of Famer. Dikembe Mutombo might have four. But I don't think he's a Hall of Famer either, just for the record. I'm just I'm just saying. I, I you do just think, don't like Hall of Famer. No, 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 no. I'm just saying. To the point, you just don't there like defense. That is not true. Let's just say you want the Hall of Fame to be glitz and glamour with all the guys that score the points and get the fame and you don't want the, the dirty work guy no not 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 all my thing is i do think ben wallace was a worthy all-star i think he was a worthy all nba second and third team i'm not discounting that the hall of fame is an exclusive club i know in basketball it's easier to get in because it's the basketball hall of fame i just i don't think he's a hall of famer i would put ben wallace in hall of really really good i would put chauncey in the hall of fame over oh, what <laughs> Are you disrespecting Chauncey now? Chauncey? No, no, no. You're disrespecting Ben. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I'm not disrespecting Chauncey, but you would put Chauncey in before Ben? Absolutely. On what merit? I mean, he was the finals MVP. Okay, was, that's one. He was great in Denver. He was. Whoa, 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 whoa. He was great in Denver? Yes, he was. Yes, he that's, was. What, what, what is that? How do you quantify that? He was uh, great in Denver. He was the best. What did he do in Denver? Did they win a championship? Did no, they, they get to the finals? They no. They got the farthest no. of Carmelo he's ever gotten they because he get, had, They didn't get anywhere. Oh, they got the furthest. The, the they, furthest. They, they the furthest. And you get it. Hey. We don't win. We don't win the championship without Ben Wallace. I agree with you. I what agree are you saying? You. I'm saying that he's not the biggest reason that you guys won he, the championship. He, he obviously, the, he, he obviously the don't. He was the heart and soul of the Pistons. The heart and soul. That's like not you are the fame. heart and soul of the haters. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. That's the bottom. That's the bottom.